What's up, guys? It's Codex, and we are back in Elden Ring. We are in Mogwin Dynasty down here in the underground. Now, earlier this morning, I showed you how to get here super fast at the beginning of the game using a special item to grant yourself an audience with Mog. And from there, I actually backtracked around and went down and I came up to the Palace Approach Ledge. So from here, I just kept uh, the canyon on my left hand side and then turned into mountain kept that on my left hand side didn't go into the alcoves and popped up right here at the palace approach ledge and this is one of the most op farming spots in the game first i'm going to show you the not so op one so you see that chicken down there he's going to come down here and we're going to basically just peg him with an arrow and he's going to commit suicide and fall off the ledge the easiest way to do that is to click in your R3 and target lock them. Don't try to uh, do it manually because it is a pain in the butt. Make sure you don't lock on those guys too. And you just fire back. The chicken will get confused, run right off the cliff, and boom, as you see in the bottom right-hand corner, it's going to be an easy 26,000. But that's not really the farming method we're looking at here. We're actually looking at this one with this wave of gold so i'm going into my equipment and i'm using the sacred relic sword it's only plus eight right now i do want a plus ten it but the main reason why i'm using it is for its ability wave of gold and we're just going to go in here uh unique skill wave of gold imbued the sword with bygone gold and glory and fired at foes a wide golden wave fans out towards where it's sleeping through all enemies caught in its path so this is one of the easiest ways to farm down here and of course I hit it off but uh, as you see it just gets everybody and on one quick run you easily get over 100k and then you just win rinse and repeat I do not recommend getting the chicken every time it's just really really slow I just want to show that off in case you do not have the proper stats to use the sacred relic sword because it does require strength 14 dexterity 24 and faith 22 but it is so worth the respect and getting some of those extra faith points to do this farm otherwise if you do not want to respec or you can't respec and you just want to do the chicken method you can use a pulley bow only requires 11 strength and 11 dexterity make sure you also pick yourself up a golden scarab which increases the Ruins obtained from defeated enemies. So that'll help uh, your farm be a little bit quicker using that sacred relic sword. And it's just really, really unfair on how much you can get in a single run. So it definitely is worth a little bit of a respec. I always run up a little bit more to grab the stragglers just because this isn't uh, in prime condition yet. Normally, when this is plus 10, you won't have any stragglers like that guy right there. It will just kill them. So you can get upwards up to a million a minute, depending on how fast you are doing the runs. And if your sword is level, uh, level 10 there, you can just go up there, hit it once, and Bob's your uncle. You got yourself a million ruins an hour a minute farm. If you guys like this video, make sure to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and make sure you take a look at this morning's video, Mogwin's Castle, how to get there super early with only defeating Godric. Have a good night, guys. I will see you next time.